Hello, welcome. My name is Emily and this is the project Partners in Cream and it was start by, started by Delin and Steph Lyons. They are linked down below and I'm doing all lip stuff this year because I thought it was kind of fun. All, all of the lip products are uh, in cream form. Most lip products are, so it's kind of easy. And um, this is a pretty good update, actually. Um, and most I have good progress on and some not that much. I have empties and I have new stuff and old stuff. So we will start with the empties and first we have a almost empty product that has gone bad and that is the Clarence Lip Perfector uh, in number 7, I th no, 16. This one uh, is, I can show you, the, it's an air bubble down here, but I think I'm about down there. You can see it's almost flat up here and that is air. And I'm considering this done. My lips felt so bad while I used this and I couldn't understand what it was. But then I tried to stop using different things and when I got to, to this one it immediately got better and but it took a while, like almost two weeks. And I, I still think um, my lips are a bit um, bad. I, I can't find word, words, but they are kind of dry and uh, strange. And when I used this, they were like red and plump <laughs> and very, I can't describe it. They were very sore in a way. So this has gone bad, unfortunately, but uh, I used most of it. So I'm not that sad. And I ended up at 13.14 grams and I started at 17.55 so that means that I've used a 4.4 4 .4 grams. This contains 12 milliliters but I had used it before so if I um, I am guessing I think it's maybe 2 grams left something like that and I used up most of it so um, it's fine but it's it's kind of sad that I bought it and didn't use it up. And I like the color and yeah, I can show you the color, but it smells, ooh, bad. It's very, oh, I got, got a lot of it out. You can see, really see the color there. And so it's beautiful, but yeah, it's going and it's fine. Mm. Mostly I'm sad about how my lips got, but they're fine now, so that's that. Then we have another empty, and that is the Catrice Restoring Overnight Lip Mask. I knew it was going to be empty last time, so I already have brought in a new product for it, but this is empty now, and this felt bad also during the time I used the Clarence one, because this is like a bit minty it's lavender and shea butter but it's kind of minty so it was kind of stingy so i'm glad to have this done too i used up 0.8 grams since the last update and you can see it's flat and empty and one more empty <laughs> we have a lipstick a lip crayon the lord and barry maximat in intimacy finally i'm done with this it's not sharpenable anymore and i'm done i actually have it on now uh, this was my last use and you can see it's very flat so i really had to um, uh, it was hard to use it <laughs> yeah uh, so this is finally done. I worked on it last year, so I'm glad to have it done and a lipstick. So that's really good. Then I'm going to show you a bonus empty and that is the Dr. Lip Original Nipple Balm. This one also done. I um, 
have to squeeze a lot to get something out maybe i have one or two uses left yeah it's coming out a little bit but it's a nice lip balm and i'm calling it down you have never seen it before in this project but i used it when i felt so sore on my lips when i used the clarence one one so this has been a savior um this past weeks so yeah one bonus product out and now back to the products that I have worked on and that you have seen before. We can start with this Tromborg or something lip cure. That is a very strange, this is a very strange product. It is like a cream, but not quite. And I really don't like it, but it's, it's usable. So I'm using it. So I am there and I'm using it at night and it's gonna go slow, but it was new here so the, this whole tube is so unnecessary and I'm sweating and yeah and I'm sorry about the noise I think you can hear it it's uh, air air conditioner did I say that before air cooler yeah, but it's necessary it's so hot here in Sweden now so that has gone down how much uh, to one and a half gram so I will keep on working on this one. And we have, what else do we have? We have, we have the Givenchy, uh, Le Rouge Givenchy in ro Rose Taffetas. Rose Taffetas, I don't know. Oh, I'm sweating. Ha! Huh. Do I have a fan here? No. I have lots of fans, but I have taken it somewhere else. So it is this one. And I have great progress with this one. You can see here, not much left. And you can see it even more on the paper. Look at my progress there. Sorry about the <laughs> lipstick there. But a good jump here on this. And I'm glad about that because I think lipsticks are hard. And it's very slanted. So I guess... Uh, when I'm down to the plastic on this side, it's going faster. So, yeah, I'm not in a rush, but I'm glad to have progress and good progress also. Oh, I'm sorry. You have seen me done this many times before and yeah, the season is here. <laughs> okay. Uh, 0.4... Seven grams I used up on that one and then we have the lip shimmer from Burt's Bees in the shade fig I haven't used this that much because this is all also uh, a bit stingy it was stingy for my lips when they were sore uh, because it contains peppermint oil so I have really taken a break from this too but it's not bad or that so I only use up 0.04 grams of this so not much and this one I have used once the Ilamasca Lava Lips. I can't do another mark on my paper and it's supposed to be like this, but I haven't used it. I have, yeah, as I said. But I have um, pulled in something else into this project that I'm using. This was full and now I'm there. It's the Tower 28 uh, Lip Cure in in what coconut coconut yeah I have weighed it now but I didn't weigh it when I started and why I put pulled this in this is not old or anything but this has been uh, it has been um, the shade is miscolored or I don't know what to say but this one and the color pop lip gloss both of them went like this so I want to use them up and it's nothing wrong with it it's just like that so yeah hopefully I have good progress on that one and my goal for next time is this one it's kind of doing its thing once a day I have five products in now yeah so I think I want to focus on this one a bit more and try to get a good uh, usage on that one this I will just use as I feel like because it's kind of new in this project 
and my go and this one too but this one i need to use at least 10 times or so but it's very dark i can do a little swatch here i don't think it shows up dark on my hand but i don't know it's very i don't know we will see but i i need to use it so that's it um please subscribe if you don't already that would be very nice i I, I'm gonna sweat now, so if you do, you will see me do like that, do it like this. I'm sorry, but that's how it is. <laughs> and hope to see you in another video. Bye bye.